Greetings from Marlborough House. I'm grateful for this opportunity of saying a few words to you at this important Commonwealth event. May I express gratitude on behalf of the wider Commonwealth family to Prime Minister Peter O'Neill and to the government and people of Papua New Guinea for their continuing commitment to the Commonwealth and their hospitality in hosting this conference. I also greet the Honourable Prime Minister of Tuvalu, patron of the Commonwealth Local Government Forum, ministers from the Pacific, senior officials and other Commonwealth friends. The Commonwealth Local Government Forum makes an immense contribution towards consolidation of democracy at a level where the citizens benefit the most from it in their daily lives. We recognize its potential for embedding our core values of democracy, development, and respect for diversity within our communities. And from these foundations, to build them into all aspects of national life and globally. The focus for your deliberations is to be on Pacific futures, building our communities. You will be exploring how best to support local communities in the context of sustainability, service delivery and governance. The interdependent relationship of democracy and development is a Commonwealth approach that has stood the test of time. It is rational and it is wise. It provides tools for building resilience and inclusiveness. It advances local, national and regional development through governance that is both responsive and responsible. Development, whether social or economic, depends on reliable and efficient infrastructure and utilities, such as sanitation, roads, schools, and healthcare facilities with accountable and responsive delivery of public services at local, district, and regional levels. Successful development is achieved through an inclusive approach, consulting widely and embracing diversity. This is how local government has an important role in building stable, safe, and equitable communities. The newly adopted Commonwealth Charter sets out the values and principles for which we all stand. By them, we seek to advance development, resilience, rights of citizens, and social and economic inclusion. The Charter speaks of the importance of representative local government and of sustainable development. It deserves to be widely shared with your colleagues and fellow citizens. At the Commonwealth Heads of Government meeting in Colombo last year, the leaders, and I quote, recognize the role which local government in particular can play in enhancing the exercise of democratic governance in the defining and delivery of essential services, as well as in promoting economic development. End of quotation. The heads endorsed the 2013 Kampala Declaration on Developmental Local Government, together with the accompanying Munyonyo Statement on Local Government's role in the post-2015 development agenda, as well as the Declaration of 2014 as the Year of Developmental Local Government. I wish us all success over coming days in, in your deliberations and in your ongoing efforts in strengthening the welfare of local communities and serving their aspirations.